I got zero friends. Is there a difference between rumination and worrying? Yes, there is. While both rumination and worrying refer to passively and repetitively thinking about one's personal problem or one's personal distress in a way that is problem pondering but not problem solving and that leads to emotional distress. Whilst rumination focuses on the past and the present, worry is futuristic in nature. So worrying focuses on problems, anticipates problems in the future, problems to come that have not happened. You know, so you're thinking about the future and you're worrying about the events in the future. You're anticipating a problem. You're anticipating for things to go wrong. So that's worrying. So whilst rumination dwells on the past and the present, worrying dwells on the future. But both are repetitive, um, passive thoughts about problems and personal distress. They're not problem solving. No, they're just problem pondering, just thinking over and over and over about the problem. Not thinking of how to solve it, not looking for a way out, but just thinking about even things that we cannot control. And imagine worrying about things that have not even happened yet. What rumination and worrying do to us is that they rob us of enjoying and really living our lives. So instead of living in the present, we are either stuck in the past or somewhere in the future. And when we are in the present, we are not enjoying life, we are not living, we are not experiencing things as we should. We are stuck in our thoughts. We are hidden somewhere away in our thoughts and just thinking, wasting useful time. So let's quit worrying. Let's quit ruminating over the things we cannot control, over problems that have already happened. If something has happened in the past, move on, okay? Find a solution, prevent the problem from repeating itself, but don't dwell on it. If you're in the present and things have not gone the way that you wanted them to go, accept them and work towards a change. And for the future, prepare. Prepare for challenges, for eventualities, but do not worry. Okay, guys, that's it for today. Don't worry. Be happy. Ciao.